Who's ready to get your fill of risk? I'm Phil. I'm a top grandmaster playing risk global domination. On my channel, we talk strategy. So for tips, tricks, and techniques, subscribe and follow. Today I'm playing Classic Fixed with Blizzards and Portals. And we also have um, Balance Blitz, Alliances on, No Filter and Rank, Neutral Bot, Stable Portals. Okay. That sucks, but that happens. I think Black made a bad move, like, but it's not terrible. They still have 21 troops. So I think now I go for Europe, maybe. Make an alliance with Orange. Attack over. Maybe I attack up and fortify over. Attack over. Fortify up. Oh man, look at this. Everyone wants South America. Awesome. Maybe attack with my four and make an army here. Possibly save a troop this way. And make an alliance with Orange. So hopefully Orange just doesn't smoke me. Oh, I already tried. I can go for North America or I can go for Europe. Depending on what Orange does. Um, Orange has a good Europe play and they have a good African play. That's not bad. They might get to keep it. Two people have already tried for Australia. My hope is that Orange is not good and that they try for Australia as well. Hey, a new one mobile. What's up? Global something. Good luck. Thank you. I did get four troops smacked on the, on the first turn by Black. So I think Orange is going to go for Africa based on that. And I might be able to save the troops in the middle of Europe. I could go through here too. Yeah, they're they're making an African claim. So if I put one here and fortify up, I might be able to like save these troops. And then eventually I can come over into Europe or North America and decide later what I want to do. It's not a terrible spawn. It depends what Orange does. Because you have a three-border Europe, and no one seems to be going for North America. The worst part about my spawn was I had these five troops in. Um, they're going to fortify in. Cool. I had these five troops in South America that are just being gone. Or six troops in South America that are gone. So we got a bunch of people fighting over South America. And now Black's like, what do I do? They probably hit my two here. What should they do? They should get a one. Yeah, they're going to hit my two, right? They've hit they've hit me so hard. Now they're going for Europe. I'm gonna I'm gonna need cards, guys. I'm gonna need cards for sure. Who is black? Stop hitting me. I would like to save this three, because this two's gone. I'm just in a rough spot. Like the the amount of times recently, I've just been in a rough spot from the moment I started.
So I roll this 3v1. Or just leave it. You think Black's going to hit it next turn? Probably in two turns. So red botted. Hi. I have 21 troops. Not that bad off. It just depends on if Black hits me again. If I can survive to the trade, I should be okay to like no continent, build up, and then eventually get one of these continents. But if I decide that I want North America, what would I do if I was orange? Now Africa's not that good. Yeah, come in here. Okay, so my three is in a lot of danger. Why? Why splitting? Why splitting so much? And I don't see a way out. And I bet black hits that three next turn. Oh. Uh. So if this... So I think I spend out my three if it survives. If not, I get a card and pass. Three cannons, I definitely would trade in three cannons. Um, I should hit a one and pass, really. I'm getting smoked like every turn. We're going to hit the three. They're going to go, they're going to go ham on this. I need to roll both the three and the two. I'm just going to roll the three. They're both gone. There. Yeah, I have three cannons. I should survive. What's up, Andre? How you doing? Lark Moonborn. Had someone suicide into me today. And I followed on Phil's tips and pulled out a second place by laying low and letting the others fight it out. Yeah. You got it. You got to do what's right for the game, right? If the game dictates you laying low and let others fight it out, then do that. If you can create a lead and go after it, create a lead and go after it. Yeah. Because I have three cannons, I don't think that black... Yellow can't take me out, and I don't think black's going to be able to. So I think I will survive. My last play may look crazy to you guys. So let me explain. This three is gone. So if I add one to it, that one is gone. Okay. One might be gone if I attack here anyway. Right. This 15. So if I can get something out of that three, I save one. Okay. This two is gone. If I add anything to it, those troops are gone as well. The troops will be gone if I add them here and attack anyways. So it was actually a troop conserving move to do that. Um, it seems crazy, but it's actually what it was. Okay. Yeah, it's always good. John and Amanda, chill like Phil and take Australia. <laughs> take Australia. I don't take Australia right away, usually. If, if it's given to me, I will. With all this hitting Black's been doing, they're still quite big. This type of player that's going to hit, hit, hit like this is not the type of player that's going to let you just hold the continent next to them on average.
So they're going to have 18. I'm going to have 28. And I would have to punch through four extra to get this bot. I don't think I'd do that. Hill is also a possible kill. I'd have to punch through one, two, one, two, three, four more if I came down up and over I could kill yellow and take South America but again I don't think it's worth it orange pretty straight shot on orange they have 19 troops again I, I don't think these are all risky kills and black is going to get to hold. So they're going to be big. If you conceivably killed black, it would have been a risky kill as well. So at this point, I think maybe I hit this box two so that there's no more twos here. And I slowly take North America's. So this bot will, will keep adding here. But we'll never take another card. So if I want to take North America and passively hold it, maybe on this portal, the first thing to do is get rid of the bot too and hope to get a good roll. What's up, Jolie? How you doing? You've never seen me take Australia early game. They lost zero on a, on a seven before. Yeah, I wish you could see other people. KD, that would be cool. I don't know, maybe I end up killing this bot. Do I want to kill anybody? Twenty-seven punching through a few extra and leaving some behind. Using a heart for I can also kill the bot. Cool. Got 37 points, my two games in the Chaos Tournament. That's good. I'm not really sure what the Chaos Tournament is. They don't want me to hit them. Hello there. Hello there. I'll say it too. We're all having a good time. Hello there's the best. The Australian turtle. <laughs> That's funny. Little princess. Black orange. Sure. Take Fortify out, I might just take the continent. Do I die if I take the continent? Or 
Mine says five cards. I get to them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Add eight, it's 24. I mean, he can take me out. They're taking out orange. Good, good play. They should probably take out red while they're at it, right? They, they... Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. One moment. I like that play. I didn't feel strong enough to do that myself. So I like that play. I think that yellow attacks them. They might attack me instead. No, pink is good. They have an anarchy flag. They made a good kill. Oh my. I have a big trade. I put some troops here. Kill anybody with a big trade. Uh, yeah, he is getting big. He's actually, like, full-grown now. Tell me I'm taking too long. I gotta get a card somewhere, right? Oh, they did a three, though, so that's interesting. It's interesting. Attack, but not on that portal, I think. Take your time and do you, you boo. Yeah. Oh, they hit the eight instead of the one? What is happening? They refuse to attack pink. Does this play out? Pink has more cards than me. If these go to go into all out war, I get second. Okay, you can go down now. Say bye.
taken off the border, trying to show like some love to this yellow player. I haven't broken you. I'm demilitarizing my border. Let's be cool. We all have big bonuses except for yellow. Yellow struck black pretty hard. They could end my game. They could end anybody's game. I should have take turns hitting us, I think. But hit ones. Oh, are they going to end my game? That's the proper play. Hmm. Oh, they're hitting black super hard. It's so hard they hit black. Black has a trade. Do they slam yellow? If they slam yellow, then what? Yeah. It's reestablished. That's the right thing to do. Oh. Um. I kill yellow. Do I kill black too? See where we're at troops wise. I didn't think I'd beat pink in the 1v1 in that situation. Black. I don't get the instant trade if they do that. Yeah. I were in a 1v1. Ah, maybe I should try to kill black or broken yellow. I get the instant trade. Shoot, they get me. They're up way too much. What's my trade? Is it big? It's a big trade. Bad roll, bad roll. Good luck. I think I need to break pink. Has a Okay. Um, this is fine. 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 I left their 19 so couldn't attack very much, but they still hold too much board. 
I should have attacked a 2v1. This, there's no winning this, but I'm going to give him a hard time. Is there a Grandmaster? What do you guys think? Yeah, I needed black in the game. I needed pink not to know to take out black. And also, I probably should have attacked pink. All right, 43 to 23 after your turn, going to be <laughs> um, That's fun though. I think it's a good one. And I, I survived till the end. So I think it'll go on YouTube. Yeah. Our alliance was broken? No. Let's check out who these people were. Let's check it out. Like that was that was an intense intense battle. I think I should have broken paint. I'm gonna rewatch it, but I think I should beginner novice master. Little princess is a master, intermediate beginner. I don't even know where my rank points were, to be honest. I think they just went up. Does that make sense? 349? That they would go up? Cool. Subscribe and follow.